Oh, that's right, yo. The babes, man. These are like, these are the shoes that Rice Gum made a video on. And what is going on, legit nation? Where it always stays lit on legit vlogs, guys. Today's gonna be dope. Today's gonna be epic. Today's gonna be. We're starting off the vlog in the in the in the restroom, which probably isn't a good place to start off the vlog. Guys, this morning we are headed to a soccer tournament, a soccer game. Soccer. Uh, is it army going to soccer? We're going to see football. Oh, we're going to see football We're gonna go see a football game from her little brother. So we're headed over there right now But before we go legit trivia of the day What is the most nutritious part of my breakfast every single day a vitamins? B breakfast C tacos or D a and C I'll give you a second to answer that if you answered C you are correct, my friend. Breakfast taco. Now let's head over to the football game. So the game barely started. First play. And they're already hurt. Two people. Look, there's brother. That's brother who we came for. All he's doing is holding up a sign. He's not playing yet. <laughs> <laughs> You're mean. Uh-oh. They're fighting. Okay, guys, so right now we are headed towards Austin, Texas, baby. Your boy is going back to Austin. Reason why is because we are going to Texas Shoe Exchange. We are gonna go find the cloudiest shoes out there, and we're gonna see what we can find. Today we're joined by Retro Game Hunters. We're doing a little collab. What is up, RGA squad? Don't honestly, worry. when the Retro Game Hunters hit me up for a collab, I honestly didn't want to do it because he only has like a thousand subscribers, but I was like, you know what? You're my dad, so basically he gave birth to me, so I have no choice but to do a collab with him, so we're gonna do a collab today. So go subscribe to him if you're not already, but let's go to Austin. Whoa. We're here at a garage sale right now on our way to Austin. Now, I don't usually stop at garage sales, but my dad really wanted to stop at this garage sale just because that's what he does on his video game channel. He hunts for retro games. So while we're at this garage sale, I actually found a table full of hats. Shout out to LeVar Ball one time for the Lakers, but that is not what's important here. Today we found a super steal of 50 cents for this hack, guys. 50 cents for this hat, guys. Super Bowl 30 champions, Cowboys right there with the sticker and the tag. This thing is completely dead stock for only 50 cents. What a deal. Anyways, we're gonna buy this real quick and then we're gonna hop on our way to Austin back at it again. All right guys, so we just arrived at Texas Shoe Exchange inside of Austin, guys. We made it and they actually have the bus sitting out here. They must be going on some type of trip or something like that. Uh, usually they hit up all the sneaker cons and stuff. Check out this bus right here. But anyways, we're gonna hop inside and see what they got today at the store, see what they're selling, see what they got. Let's go inside. Here we go. Yo, what is this? My first Air Jordan ever? Is this like a sign or something? That's crazy. They got some shoes over here, some sign Jordans over here. Why? It's a five. It's a five? Let me see it. She's been wanting some Yeezys for a long time. But they're zebras. But you don't want those. You want the whites. They have small sizes. Beth has been trying to get some Yeezys for a long time in a size five. So we're looking for a size four. five. In a size four. That's right. In a size four. In the white cream colorway. These are a size five. So a little bit too big. But they got a lot of heat today, guys. They got a lot of heat. They got the human races, which I hadn't seen these here yet. We found some fake ones of these at the flea market the other day. They still have the vape ones. These are 750. Oh, that's right, yo. The babes, man. These are like, these are the shoes that Rice made a video on, and uh, he showed his mom that he bought these. These shoes, I believe, they're going for a thousand dollars, and they are the Bape NMDs. Pretty sick, pretty sick shoe. Got another Bape NMD, and then the other human races. Yeezy cleats. Oh, I've been wanting these. The tans. These are so clean. 775, size 10 and a half. That's my size. Oh, those are nice. Yeah. These are really nice. I have the I have the pirate black so far. I'm sorry that they don't have yours. <laughs> All these NMDs down here. There's a Supreme bike. I was on that Supreme bike. I have a picture on my Instagram. If you guys want to see me riding that Supreme bike, go follow me on Instagram. It's in the actor. They got the uh, Babe Adidas jacket. Pretty cool. And they got a Keymaster over here. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Yo, guys, they got this sneaker head. Louis Vuitton Supreme type of thing. Sneaker head right here. Jordan on the floor. Wow. That is sick. Yo, those signs are sick, bro. 950 for that bandana. It's crazy, right? <laughs> um, they look pretty good, but if they're gonna be too big, I wouldn't get them for you. I know, they only have a four and a zebra. Then patience. I know, we might, I'm waiting. We might be able to find them tomorrow at the show. And what I really want to try to see if they have is those GMP or DMP, I forgot, I think it's GMP. 13s, Air Jordan 13s. I've been wanting those for a minute and I'm not sure if they have them here today. Size 10 and a half. It looks like they don't. All they got is these 13s. They got the Chris Paul 13s. 
and some lows, but I really want to try to look for those uh, GMP 13s because I love those gold shoes. I really, really do love gold shoes. <sighs> but we're gonna see what they do have. Ooh, they got the Just Dawns. I've been needing to get these again. I once had these in my collection, but I traded them for Yeezys. The hype was too real. Hype was too real. Are these the ones? Mm, no, these aren't the ones. $100 and under section steals and deals, man. $100 and under. Can't beat that, yo. Can't beat that. Bunch of good shoes in here. Bunch of really cool shoes in here. $100 and under. They got some heat in here. Personal ones? All right, personal, not for sale. Man. Those are coming in December. Yeah. And those are coming in Black Friday. Pretty sick, guys. Early Jordan 11s. Wow. All right, so they got two pairs of early Jordans. When they went to Hong Kong, they found a guy, hooked them up. They got the all red Air Jordan 11. These are coming out in December, I believe. And then these are going to come out for the Black Friday release. Now, they're kind of like the Concords, but not exactly the Concords. I kind of wish they would drop the Concords again. But these are still fresh. But these for sure are going to be for sure cop for me when it comes around December time. All red Air Jordan 11. Just so fresh, man. So we actually found these in a thrift store one time, but they were actually obviously fake. It's funny that we found these a couple years ago, and now they're actually releasing them the captain america jordan my new favorite jordan the captain america <laughs> jordan i think i cop these they're 400 i can do this adidas did it better uh, not enough blue and red though. yeah i think the, the jordan one goes better sorry babe so much louis vuitton <laughs> the retails are high on those too yeah. the jacket is 6500 4, no, 4, uh -huh. the, the baseball jersey is 65. 65. These are 65 each. All right, so Texas Shoe Exchange always holds it down for your boy. It's always lit at Texas Shoe Exchange. It's pretty bright out here. But um, yeah, guys, they reminded us about a show tomorrow, so I know we didn't announce. What are you doing? Over that rock. She's literally kicking a rock. All right, so anyways, we will be out at the uh, event tomorrow. It's going to be at the AT&T Center. We didn't announce it to you guys. I'll probably post it on social media tonight. But tomorrow, we're going to get some footage at that sneaker event. It's Spurs sponsor, baby. You know the legit nation is going to be out there. So we'll, we'll see you tomorrow. But we're going to do some more stuff before we leave Austin. So let's make today a very legit day all right guys so we're here at game over which is supposedly they have a lot of retro games here including new games so they got a lot of stuff here a lot of games so if you guys like video game lovers like myself then you guys are gonna have a blast here guys they have so many figures oh my god look at all these disney infinity too bad when me and beth were in disney infinity we didn't come over here because they have so many infinity figures they have like every infinity they have more than we have are you gonna scream or what Princess Ona. Damn, Princess Ona. GameCube. Dude, I've never seen anything like this. My little brother would love this because they always play Smash. So this is like the ultimate like Smash system. But yeah, all this is like all this like really old stuff that my dad's into. So check that out. Power Glove. That's like some Fallout type of stuff over here. Um, They even have where you could like 30 time game limit. You can like test out games and stuff. Yo, this place is pimped out boy if i lived here in austin i would come here straight up with my boys we would be playing on this little look check this out man this little system i don't even know what game this is a, a nintendo 64 wow well before my time kids well before your time too yeah we're gonna look around a little bit have a little bit of fun this was my first like game that was like as girly as this may sound this game right here changed my life like for the better like this is what made me addicted to games like i played games before but this is what officially made me addicted to games i know it sounds stupid it sounds like a little girl but this was it right here <laughs> i kind of want to buy a gamecube now for the house gamecube we're supposed to get another don't system. tell them what we're supposed to get. i said another it's system. A system i said another are system Guys, why are you trying to... i didn't say the game trying... control oh my gosh hide that on camera what are you doing <laughs> you're playing nintendo uh, super uh, I don't 64 know what I'm playing. 64 so since i like elder scrolls so much a lot of people have been telling me to try out dark souls i feel like it's kind of similar i might go ahead and try it out it's just a little bit more evil if you will but i'm, I'm, I'm kind of scared to play it but i might have to try it out for myself we'll see so that's pretty much it for us to my dudes we're about to head back to sa and get lit some more so i'm not sure what we're gonna do yet jp hit me up we might do something a legit so stay tuned let's get to it all right guys so now we're with the boys downtown i know it's a couple hours later but we're gonna try out this burger culture it's like a little burger stand we're with the homie JP. what's up your boys what's up what's up we're with the homie jose and uh jacob and um anyways guys real quick before we hop over to this burger place i want to show you this piece of artwork that my uncle actually made if you guys didn't know my uncle's an artist local artist here in san antonio he usually does the artwork for the spurs that's all him right there guys this is all him he painted all that like that's pretty legit bro so anyways we're probably gonna go check out his work in a little bit and show you guys but we're gonna check out these burgers and see how they are all right so what is this place wow Beatles, what Jimi hendrix uh carlos santana man this guy is a pro honestly fam it's pretty good it's pretty lit out here Let me turn right, we're still waiting. never mind we'll get back to that all right what is it from a one to ten it's like a seven 
It's all right. He's still in middle well, school. His taste buds, are, his taste buds haven't acted yet. They haven't school. developed. They haven't developed. Oh, high school, never mind. Freshman. All right, we're at my uncle's art gallery right now. Um, second Saturday of the month, they usually have events here, so we decided to come through and check it out. Social, show some support. Oh shoot, we're getting honked at, bro. Bro. All right, fam. Tell me what this reminds you of. This reminds. What does it speak you? What does it speak to you? In my life, it speaks to me of mustard, lettuce, and uh, relish. Relish, or whatever. Get out. Get out, please. So we yeah, had second Saturday. I'm not sure what we're doing here, but we're here chilling. I'm a vlogger. What are you? What are you? I'm a I'm a vlogger. What does that mean? Oh, it means that I post videos on YouTube. For what? For entertainment. <laughs> Yo, that girl did not know what vlogging is. You know what that means? She's too old. I'd like to purchase today, woman. I think I'm saying her name right. Frida Kahlo. Is there anything that you would like to purchase in my studio today? Yeah. Would you like this one? It's only $485. Everything's closed. It's that crazy. What do you mean that crazy? Go in there and just... <laughs> it's screaming. about the art, bro. You gotta chill, bro. Right, it's, all, right. it's about the art right. flow, bro. And just like that, Legit Nation, we are back at the Legit Pad. Man, your boy has got church early in the morning, guys, so I'm gonna end up this vlog on a little note, guys. Now, we're gonna go through the daily verse of the day like we always do. So, without further ado, let's go. Romans 5, 8 says, But God shows his love for us in that while we were still sinners, Christ died for us. While we were still sinners, Tim, how am I a sinner? I haven't done anything that bad. I've never really... We are all sinners, guys. If you said one lie in your whole entire life, which the lie is that you've never sinned, then obviously you're a sinner now even though we're sinners even though we go and stab Christ in the back every time we commit a sin every time we look at somebody lustfully every time that we lie every time that we cheat every time that we steal Christ still died for us because he loves you he loves you and me very much that he died on that cross he rose up three days later and he now lives and you guys can have Jesus Christ in your heart all you got to do is ask him and welcome into your heart and he will live in you forever guys that is the only way that you can truly be saved is to have a relationship with Jesus Christ and ask him to come into your heart guys yo guys thank you so much for watching today's video i love you guys i hope you guys are feeling entertained i hope you guys are enjoying these vlogs only better content coming and until tomorrow guys stay tuned because we're about to go to a sneaker event so until tomorrow guys you know the deal peace homies stay blessed we are out of here